the services that keep our team employed year-round. Hey everyone, I'm Jacob, the owner of Scooters Lawn Care, and my channel helps contractors deliver and clients experience a luxurious everyday life through property transformations. If you like the sound of that, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit the like button for this channel. And if you're a contractor, be sure to check out jacobgodar.com. There are a ton of useful resources on there to help you grow your business. So let's get right into it though what you've been waiting for, the services that keep our team employed year round. And what do I mean by year round? We're not just a seasonal company. You know, our admin staff, our field staff, they stay working all throughout the year. Our goal is to every year be able to keep more and more field team members busy all winter so they have a consistent paycheck year around so the holidays don't become a hard time for them because they're getting laid off you know so they have this reliable job that they know that when i get signed on here when i get going when i move up in the ranks there that i'm going to be working year round all the time and with that snow just has not been the answer you know snow is what everyone does they plow snow you know anybody in our business and construction businesses it's a typical thing that they do in the off season but it just hasn't proven to build consistent work and it also goes against our company's values you know our values of our uh, employees having a, a, a family focused business to work in you know what it does do is it gives them less hours and keeps them working long hours in holiday seasons right before right before New Year's right around Christmas Christmas evening you know when it snows you're there no matter what and it just didn't really align with our company values and, and I knew if it didn't align with our values we wouldn't be able to serve our clients at a high level but luckily there's still a lot of contractors that love and thrive off of providing snow plowing services. But with all that being said, the services that we have found that have aligned with our company that have worked so well, the people we keep on, you know, they're gonna have a certain skill set to be working through the winter. Once they've moved up in the company and they've been able to acquire those skills, they're on, they're involved in building in the outdoors, they do a lot of these creative things, doing it outdoors, laying paver patios, that's when we start moving them into in the off season, being involved in interior painting, some super light interior remodeling things, some interior flooring, because it's stuff that we can sell to our clients that we've already worked with through all throughout the season. And now they've got a trustworthy business that they know will stand behind what they're gonna do. And it serves as work to keep our people going, to keep our team going, to make sure through the holiday season, through the winter seasons, that as many people as possible on the team have constant work so they know they don't have to be laid off and they've got a place to show up to every day and keep making clients smile. And that's, that's, that's what we're in it for, to serve and to provide top-notch quality service for our clients. So that's how we do it, interior services. I feel like on some of the other videos I've hit on on this stuff before, I haven't quite hit why we got out of snow and it, it just didn't mesh with our values. It, it, it just, it was hard on our team. It was hard to schedule and there just wasn't enough of it and it was always seeming to be in bad times. It just strained and broke everything. So moving forward, this is what we've been doing. It worked out great last year and I'm excited to do even more of these new services during the off season because we picked up even more skilled people that brought previous skills in these areas to our team. Everyone, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you came up with creative ideas just from watching this on how to stay busy in the off season. If you did, leave it in the comments below. I would love to hear them and make sure to hit that like button. I'll talk to you soon.